Oh! That's paper. <laughs> Surprise! Surprise, guys, it's paper. <laughs> Welcome to a motor style. <laughs> Watch out, evil aliens! You have to say evil, otherwise the good ones might be scared too. Not all aliens are evil. Molly would know because she is an alien. Hi, Shamika and Molly. I'm writing my first feature screenplay this summer, so I spend all of my time at home, but I seem to be lacking any inspiration to actually write. Thanks. Dinosaur Unicorn Hybrid. P.S. This is written from the land of Narnia, England, and here is some pizza. Congratulations! Where you I'm go? Just, I'm just starting that. It's a big deal. That's a really big deal. Everybody find, Everybody gets a little stumped in the inspiration department once in a while. It's not a big deal. No nope. BFD. Nope. I wrote my first feature screenplay last summer, and some days I just sat around in my pajamas crying in my bed, and that didn't help at all. We'd love to see your screenplay when you're done. We'll be in it. I don't yeah. give a sh I'll show my side boobs. What's in there? I'll show all my side boobs. There it is. And my armpit vaginas. I don't care. <laughs> so the thing about being a writer or any freelance human like Molly and myself, is that you spend a lot of time at home and you can get in a rut where you think, oh, I'll just lay around in my pajamas, maybe I'll just wear my pajamas. But then sometimes you don't get any work done because you're in your pajamas the whole day and you end up eating pops and watching things on Nickelodeon. That's not gonna get you anywhere. So this top from Darling is something that's close to pajamas because it's comfortable, but it's real clothes. Silk. So, yeah, I mean, you want to feel a little fancy in your nipples all the time, no matter what you're doing. Your nipples are like a compass. The wind goes this way, and if you get this, maybe there's some inspiration over here. Maybe there's some over there. In a silk shirt, you'll be able to figure that out real easy. Give your nipples something nice for the day, and they will guide you to the inspiration you need. Yeah, that, that feels really good. The shirt, the top. Should I, should I leave you two alone? <laughs> no! <laughs> College is over. Just wear stuff that makes you feel a certain way, right? Yes. Every day, explore your different inner characters and dress them up. Mm-hmm. All right, for our next piece, we got safari-inspired shorts because maybe it's about turning your life a little bit upside down and exploring different things and setting out on adventures because sometimes when you just try to do the same thing over and over again, Nothing happens, you gotta spice it up a little bit. Inspiration can be anywhere. You could go to a park and people watch in a safari outfit with binoculars and be inspired by people that you don't know just by people watching. It's like a jungle. It's like a jungle at the park. It's like a jungle out there. So just keep your, just keep your options open. Don't just stay inside, definitely branch out. Try different things. Or just look at the same things you do in a different way people you know in a different way. You'd be a really good uh, peeping Tom. <laughs> it's a veteran, not a peeping Tom. I know, it just read creepy to me. I'd be, a, I'd be a good spy. Yeah, I'd be a great spy. Yeah. I'd also be a really good cop. Citizen's arrest! You stop, you're under arrest for crime. No crime. Hey, quit your crime. Then, because you never know when it's gonna get a little bit chilly. We've got a little bit of studs here, a little bit of Diablo Cody action. We've got a fun, quirky top, like a little Tina Fey action. And then some Nora Ephron shorts. I mean, could you get better movies than that, guys? Maybe you're writing a movie about salt. When is the sequel of that coming out, guys? I'm ready. Is there a sequel coming out? I heard there was, and then I guess there's not. And in the description box, we are gonna put a blog link to a list of 30 female inspiring screenwriters. Screenwriters. Something like that. Wait. 30 screenwriters who are, happen to have vaginas, who wrote movies, and you're gonna love it. Because sometimes a little bit of research helps out the brain. You go, girl. You go, girl. 1995. Back what? in action. Bring what? it back. You go, girl. I've been watching a ton of Charmed lately. Charmed. It's on Netflix. Ooh. I'm almost at the season finale. Sad you have to go write a screenplay. Alright, let's, sure. let's, let's help drop you out in your office. Patricia, is it gonna be about your love affair with Kevin Costner? Hey, thanks for watching Emoto Style. Make sure to subscribe to our channel by clicking on Patricia's super hot body. And uh, 
you know, you don't have to be writing a screenplay to try new things. Go out there and challenge yourself this summer. That's what the summertime's for. This is not a peeping Tom. This is an adventurer. But if you do write a screenplay, hey, we'll be in it. Yeah, like we'll be in before. it. Yeah, for part. We'll do whatever.